Today is our remaining point, uh, last point from sixth unit. What is test case? So here we'll see what is mean by test case. Test case is meant which has test data, preconditions, conditions, result, and post conditions. So this we have seen earlier in a third or fourth unit also uh, what is mean by data preconditions result and post conditions with example we we'll see now developed for a particular test scenario so test scenario that which will contains all information theoretical information about the application in order to verify the compliance against the specific requirements so text case acts as a starting point for the test execution and after applying a set of inputs values application has a defined few outputs and leaves the system at some end point or also known as a execution post condition so that means what is the result so here you see this template so what does it contains these many points this case template contains project name whatever your project name write down here your project name then test case id write down test case id test priority medium low or high media module name what is the name of your module which you are going to test then test titles that means here it for example it is given as a verify logins with valid username and password description let google log page login page so description is the google login page so description about the title so test designed by the here you can give the details designed by test designed to be executed by an execution date personal details you can write down here preconditions precondition for this model is the user has yes it user id and password unless and until they have they cannot log into the system so precondition is user has user id and password valid user id and password dependencies the next point is dependencies in a dependencies first uh, dependencies you can write means dependency on a earlier data if there are some calculations if there are some results upcoming results are there and your uh, right now this model is depending upon the previous model result. so that means the dependencies if any dependency write down or mention here the dependencies next this is the table what is the test table it contains so how to write the steps? Uh, see here. This is this number 1, 2, 3, 4. Navigate to the login page. That is the first test. This data that is user, whatever the name of the uh, login ID, you have to type that login ID. Navigate to login page. User should be able to log in. So user is Means it is uh, having invalid login, valid login. That is the expected. If it is invalid login, then the result is fail. If it is valid login, then the result is pass. So you can know write down here. Next, that is provide valid username. So valid username, uh, so username and password. It is going to be provided valid. So it is the username and uh, the dashboard that will display the the dashboard that will display username okay username and you can type it as a login id and username password username and password 
correctly entered. So there is no any test is correct. Only data is to be expected as the valid username and password. Click on the login. Expected result is login to the page. Result, whatever the actual result, if uh, username and password is entered correctly, then actual result is login to the page. Home page is to be displayed, and case is pass. Uh, this uh, is pass, and uh, if the login ID and password is wrong, is invalid at that time, the case this case is written to be. So note you can write it here regarding that. So preconditions here we have discussed user is validated with database. Preconditions means database required for that application. So user is validated with the database successfully log into the account session detail. Details are logged in a database. So account sessions that is also logged into the database. So this is the test case, one of the example prepared. Likewise, here is the test case ID, test case description, created by whom, reviewed by whom, and version. So which version you are using for the test case. To a tester logs, so few comments from Bill uh, and uh, incorporate in a version. Number of versions are created for this test cases. Tester name, mark, date, and test case pass or fail. So if it is pass, then the result is written as pass. Preconditions access to the Chrome browser. So it could be validated with only tested with the Chrome browser. User ID and password test data is to be given. So scenario verify on entering. What is a test scenario? What you have, you have to test? Test scenario is entering the valid username, user ID, and password. The customer can log in. So the steps are to be given. Test ID, details, test case, expected result, expected result, pass fail, not executed or suspended. So navigate to the page. This page site should open as expected. That is, result is as expected. Site should open. So these two results are equal. So it is pass. Next case that is user ID and password. As per user ID and password, any key can be entered. That is expected. Pass. Click on submit. So whenever it clicks on submit, then expected result is logged into the page. Result should pass. So overall module is going to be tested successfully. So test the login functionality in a banking that is pass. In this way, the test cases are to be written in a tabular format. So here you can see the example. How to write the test cases? Test case template. It is here. So format of standard test cases is to be given here. So these Columns must be fixed. Test case ID, test scenario, test steps, test data, expected result, actual result, pass and fail. Whenever expected result and actual result is matched, at that time the case is passed. Whenever these two are not matched with each other, at that time the test case is failed. Expected results means what we are expecting from this page and uh, Result that means what is coming while you are testing this page. This way it is very good. So, standard fields of this our sample test case template, unique ID for the each test case it is required. So, follow the same convention to indicate the type of test. Test case UI1 indicating user interface test case. So, here bring it with the User interface at that time, you are you can name it as a UI. Test case priority low, medium, and high. This is useful 